don't want to go next door to the magic shop. So I went next door to the magic shop. I said to the man behind the counter, have you got that amazing trick when a magician takes one, two, three, four, five, six cards, he throws away one, two, three, and yet somehow he still has one, two, three, four, five, six cards left. He said, yes, we do. I said, I'll buy it, please. So I bought it and I've got it with me right now. I'm going to perform it for you today. I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> it's the amazing six card trick. Here we go. Mm. I take one, two, three, four, five, six cards. I throw away one, two, three cards, and yet somehow I still have one, two. <laughs> Hang on, hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six cards left! Yes, 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 thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Now, uh, this right here is a new invention of mine. Last time I tried it out, it didn't exactly go well, but hopefully it will work tonight. This is the amazing Twisteroo 3179.31427936512323. Five. <laughs> As you can see, my arm goes all the way inside, and if I open this up, you can see my arm is real, correct? Yes, yes. Can you mind to make sure it's real? Sure. sure. Ah! <laughs> okay. it's, a, it's a joke. It's a, it's a joke. <laughs> now, what's going to happen is, Jonathan, is you're going to take that portion of the, uh, of the box. Right. And you're going to start twisting it nice and slowly in a sort of uh, a clockwise circular motion okay. about three times or until I start screaming out in pain, <laughs> okay. telling you to stop, OK? So I'm going to put my uh, arm in again. Okay. So if you'd like to take that portion of the box and start twisting it on you the ready? count of three. One, two, three, go! Ah, once, ah, twice, ah, three times a lady. There we go. I think that's enough. Oh, God. Oh, dear. I'd like to just uh, hold that portion of the box. You seem to have... Uh... This didn't happen last time, but you've really hurt me. Oh, God! I'm sorry, Daniel. That's not meant to happen. Now, let's try and reverse the process. Okay. Twist it round the other way, if you like. Here we go. Ah! Uh, keep going. Uh, twice! Uh. And one more time. Oh, and there we go. And hopefully, my arm is completely wow. back to normal. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Daniel Kramer. Daniel Kramer. Great performance. Let's give Pan and Tala a couple of minutes to talk. Have you ever been to Vegas before? I've, I've never been to Vegas. It would be quite amazing if I, I did. I would so love it if, as a, a result of the show, we got to send a, a boy of your age to Vegas to fully enjoy it, because I think... <laughs> I think it would be going to be one hell of an experience for you. Um, <laughs> but you did it all fabulously, and the personality you have on stage and the warmth you give off and the humour, that's a huge selling thing. I mean, that's what people will love to see you doing, I'm sure. So, you know, in a way, in a way, the magic is in the best part of the act. You're the best part of the act. That was great. Congratulations. It was really very fun. Let's see if Penn and Teller have got a clue. You just said something dead wrong. You said the magic wasn't the best part of his act. And I got to tell you, some of the stuff in there, the more you know, the better it was. The opening trick he did, I have seen Lance Burton, master magician, star of his own Vegas show forever. I've seen him do that. We've both seen him do that and his ending was not as good. Is that ending your own? No. OK. <laughs> <laughs> and that's another great thing. He's honest, isn't it? That's very rare in show business. You sold that so completely, I was sure that the ending of that was your own, because your acting was just beautiful on it. I also want to say about the, uh, the hand thing you did, what I love about that is you weren't finding some other child to torture, but you did it to yourself.